what's up guys it's the tech playoffs and i'm back with another video and this is going to be my 2021 smartphone choice of the year iphone 13 pro max now there have been a lot of amazing phones this year as well as iphones and androids um, but in terms of an all-around phone that gives me good performance good battery great camera and just compatible with every home kit you know accessory out there and um it has been amazing so this is what i've been using i have bounced between this and note 20 ultra this and z fold 3 um i had this and pixel 6 pro so this has been like i said in terms of an all-around killer uh, this is my choice of 2021 and I know you're gonna say oh, it's an iPhone everyone took to this iPhone uh, You know, this is my opinion, you know, I'm not gonna go off of what other people do or what other people say um, This is just my choice like I said in terms of everything that I use day to day um, This is my choice and I don't even have a Mac. I have a, a, a Gaming PC, so it's not that I'm in the deep ecosystem of Apple. I just trust his phone when i go out i trust it with battery i trust it with the camera and i trust it with performance and yeah lately ios hasn't been the most stable uh it, there has been bugs ever since the new ios 15. um of course with time those will get ironed out but that's every smartphone every smartphone has its issues uh even the pixel 6 pro that i've tested lately uh the, la the last android phone i tested uh that one had issues as well and i understand it's a new chip. It's a new phone. Um, once they figure out that Tensor chip and they send updates, uh, it will get better. And it might be uh, the best Android phone out there at one point. But before it gets there, uh, right now, this is my choice. iPhone 13 Pro Max. Uh, I use it every day. It, it's compatible with everything I have in terms of home assist, uh, um, home kit and home automation. Um, yeah, Siri's not the best. I I rather choose Google Assistant, but these are the apps that I use on a daily basis. As you can see on my home screen, uh, these are my choices of the widgets that I use. So this is what's on my phone right now, and then you have the app library, which I'm not the best. Uh, I, I mean, I don't like it the best as a feature. Um, I wish they gave it more of like a swipe up where you can access that. I don't like how this is in in categories, and then you have to like swipe down in order to get. The alphabetical order i think they could have done a little bit better in that uh scenario but this is like i said i'm just making a quick video uh just to show you guys which is my winner of 2021 and i know apple takes a lot of awards in 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 uh in a lot of cases with a lot of people but like I said, this is just my opinion, my choice. There has been a lot of other great phones, and I'm I'm excited for the 2021. Oh, I'm sorry, the 22 Ultra of the Samsung. I can't wait for that to come out. Um, and then we'll see if they come out with another Note. I'm sorry, Fold, because I know the S22 Ultra is going to be the Note replacement. That's going to have a pen. As if you follow the leaks in Samsung you know that's going to have a pen in it. So that's going to take over the, the Note uh, line. But I like the Fold Fold 3. Uh, I'm hoping that it has a little bit better battery life on the Z4, the Z Fold 4, because that one was a great phone, but it didn't have really good battery life. So I couldn't really go out there and depend on it. I'm a real heavy user, and I use my phone a lot with social media and directions and getting information. And that one was great, but like I said, the, on my use... I couldn't get to the full day. And I know a lot of people are like, oh, what do you mean? I get two days, I get a day and a half. It's a great phone. Yeah, it was a good phone, but everyone's use is different. Depending if you're home all day on Wi-Fi, that's gonna give you more battery. If you're out on 5G all day, that's gonna kill more battery. So it all depends on how your day was. Yeah, you can get a day, maybe day and a half, if you're home all day and you're not using 5G and you're on your Wi-Fi. So everyone's battery is gonna uh, differ depending on what they do, uh, what their scenario is. If they're outside, if they're inside, what they're doing, if they're playing games. So, but I'm not going to knock it. It was a good phone, just not up to par for me in battery life. This has been amazing. I get all day and some. Um, so that's why I keep it in my pocket. That's why I continue to use it. Yes, 
Um, I do like the iPhone, but I'm not an Apple sheep, as they say. I like to test all different sorts of phones, and I love Android as well. So I hope in 2022, uh, Android does step it up a little bit uh, and uh, update the software where it's a little bit more stable uh, to to the point where it'll uh, give you more battery life. And, and in terms of the Pixel 6 and the Tensor chip, I hope they update that uh, so they can take use of that whole chip and make it very efficient so they can get really good battery life because it has a really good camera, really good display. It just wasn't there in battery. So battery is very important to me. To a lot of people, it might not be if you're always near a charger. Me, I'm not always near a charger. I'm always on the road when I'm working. So um, I have to have something that's dependable. This is what I use. This is what I continue to use. And we'll see in 2022 what's going to be uh, next. So let me know your guys' opinion. What's your 2021 choice of the smartphone for that year? And... Uh, Give me your opinions, and we'll go from there. Other than that, guys, I just want to say thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for subscribing and giving me all the thumbs up. Uh, I just passed 500 subscribers for a lot of people. That's probably nothing, but for me, it is a big step. Uh, just thank you for the support. Thank you for watching my videos, and you, I hope you guys have an amazing new year and more an amazing 2022. You guys have a blessed day. Be safe. Peace.